Hello, my name is Aaron A.R. and I'm going to talk to you about my interview with Victoria Glazer. Victoria's been working at Bayer for five years now and she previously worked at Stony Brook Hospital where she was in HR and recruiting. She currently is in the procurement department where she does contingent labor. Uh, basically, she finds jobs that certain departments need and she finds contingent labor or contract labor to fill those positions with. Uh, she's been with Bayer for five years and she sees herself working for Bayer for a very long time, possibly the rest of her life. Uh, she lives in Clayton and works from home most of the time, and majority of her team is located in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. She's the only person on her team that is located in the RTP office. Some of the skills that she says that she uses the most is a lot of her networking skills because she works with so many different departments, and also her negotiating skills, uh, which she uses in negotiating prices for contractors. The main project that Victoria is currently working on is to get farmers license in different states because Bear has a lot of farms for uh, studies in different states and the farmers that they have on those farms, uh, bear employees or contingent laborers, need to have certain licenses to work on those farms and so she's currently working with the legal department a lot and collaborating with them uh, to get these farmer licenses to help out and make sure they get the studies done. One of the main takeaways I had with my interview with Victoria Glazer is that make sure you do a job that you are happy with. Victoria's only had three to four jobs in her career, and I've almost had eight jobs in my career, and I'm only 21 years old, and so seeing this, I've done many jobs I didn't like. Victoria, she said she loved all of her jobs, and so that's why I kind of like took that away. If a job doesn't make you happy, don't stick with it. Try to look for different opportunities and try to make the most of those different opportunities and make the best of it.